So what's going on guys? OGR here. It's game day. Let's skip the pleasantries. I'll be live with my man the sports reaction live on this channel for Giants and Rams at 4 o'clock. My ass better get going and record this video. So today I wanted to give you guys six things I want to see. Six things that I think are easily improvable that gives us a shot in this game. By no means am I going to predict us to win. I think it's foolish at this point to do so. Maybe in a couple weeks if they give me something to hang my hat on, I will. But the first thing, it's the most obvious. It doesn't matter if you watch film or if you're casual. Daniel Jones, don't turn the ball over. I want to see one or none turnovers in this game. One or less. That's all you got. Two, Jason Garrett, I'm looking at you. Some semblance of a run game. I don't care if you're running draws. I know a screen's not part of the run game, but keep this defense off balance. Make it so they can't pin their ear back and just go at Daniel Jones' ham. Run the ball at Aaron Donald. Yes, I said at Aaron Donald. And go to the left. Run so many of our runs go to the right. Go to the left. We got Will Hernandez. We got Andrew Thomas. These guys are motor graders. I'll mow the road down. Let's go to the left of that line. Majority of our runs go to the right. Why? Keep teams guessing. Three. Jason Garrett again. Wide receivers. Get open. Help your quarterback out. But more so than that, come up with some creative concepts, Garrett, in the passing game. Let's scheme our guys open. The Patriots have been known to do that for years. I'm not saying rub route because it's illegal, but rub route. <laughs> it's illegal, but you can get away with it if you do it right. Do something. Get creative. It, You know, a deep, a short, a mid route. Different levels of the defense. It makes it harder to cover. I'm looking at you, Jason Garrett. A lot of it's on you. You know, obviously, I already addressed Daniel Jones with the turnovers. Four, Graham, defensive coordinator. You're up to bat. Let's get off the field on third down. We're worse in the league. I need something from you. Scheme it, do something. Yes, at the end of the day, it's on the players to perform on the field. But obviously, part of that is your play calling. The reason why we're giving up third downs. The fifth one, I'm looking at Graham and I'm looking at him to play to the strengths of this team. If you look at our guys, our strengths are man-to-man. -man. I feel we've been running way too much zone. So let's you play to your strengths. Because San Fran was picking apart our zone all week last week. Man-to-man. -man. I'm not saying every play's got to be man-to-man. -man. Play man-to-man. Man-to-man, as Billy Packer would say. And six. Let's get a big play, a big run, a big pass, a long touchdown run. Maybe it comes from the special teams or defense. Something to fire up these guys early and give them confidence going into quarters two, three, four. So it can really, you know, let this team go forward. You get this team fired up early, maybe we got even more of a fighting chance. Maybe that even means a win. I'm going to ease off on that. And now, back to reality. My prediction. My prediction on this Rams game is Rams 28, Giants 20. If you're doing a pick them against the spread, the Giants cover. Either way, guys, it's been OGR. And I'll catch you on the next video.